All right, so today I'm going to talk about my 1980 C3 Corvette and the louvers I just installed the other day. I got these louvers from Car ID. They're plastic, ABS plastic. Um, I got I got a lot to say about these, to be honest with you. Okay, so. The starting price, what I paid for them, was $421.05, I think it was. Um, now, and it was also $100 to ship. So, for $521, you get this look on your Corvette. Now, I like the look, personally. I'm 22, so I kind of like the Louvre look. A lot of purists don't, but it is what it is. It's my car. Um, okay. $520. I I like the look, and I, I paid it because I like the look. But for $500, no, I don't think it's worth it. Um, I would try to find them someplace cheaper. I got them at Car ID. And from what I understand, it's all the same manufacturer. So it's whatever company takes the uh, the least amount of profit. You know, they took, uh, I don't know, maybe 15 to 20 days to get to my house once I ordered them. Um, and as you can hear, it kind of rattles a lot the more middle you go. You see that? It's just plastic. So you get, you get a nice look, but it's kind of cheaply made. Um, I tried to get this exact look, but aluminum, because I figured aluminum would have been better. I couldn't find them. I couldn't find them for under $1,000. Now, the louvers, you can get metal louvers. Uh, I think they're aluminum, but they are a three-piece set. So you get a piece here, you get a piece in the middle, and you get a piece on the side, and they're like bars like that. And then you get the, you know, the going across ones, the horizontal ones. Now, okay, so it doesn't fit perfectly. You can see there's like a gap, you know what I'm saying? So they're not cut perfectly. Um, and like I said, they're cheap, thin plastic that you can scratch very easily. So I'm not a fan of that either. Like I dropped them when I was trying to install them and I scuffed them up right here. So... That's wonderful. So don't drop them when you install them. Now you install them, there's like a little plate right here, right? It all comes in different pieces. You get a plate here. It's got the adhesive on um, both, no, one side. You get the adhesive on one side. So you put all the plates on, you take all the adhesives off, and then just kind of drop it on there. Or you can do it one by one and really, however, whatever you find easier. I just, I did it that way. Uh, it did come with extra pieces. I had extra pieces. Um, and then to take the louvers off, you want to screw all the caps right around the, the trim and the things come off and the heat uh, the adhesive um plates stay on so for 520 dollars you get a um uh, like a rebel style look which i like i've never personally seen a c3 with these louvers in person i've never seen one in person and i've been to dozens of car shows so this is like where i'm from kind of like one of a kind so that's why i paid it because you never, because you never really, people can find better things to do with five hundred dollars. Me, five hundred dollars. I would have liked to get the windows tinted darker, the thirty fives. I would have liked to put a tint right here, you know, maybe fifty percent tint and put like five percent tint here, because I like I like the the dark look. So that's kind of why I went with this. Because um, good luck trying to find someone to tint the back window that won't screw it up. Um, so yeah. For five hundred and twenty dollars, you get that look here. I'll show you. Oh, sorry, I got clothes in here. I'm kind of just cleaning around. Um, so that's what it looks like on the inside, right? You do get a crazy blind spot right there, right there. When you're trying to back out, I have to back out of here and then back out onto my street. So it's hard to see, but it's it's doable. Sorry, I'm kind of cleaning out my truck and I didn't want to leave all my clothes just on the floor, so I threw them in there. So yeah. Um, that's the look you get. It doesn't cut out as much sunlight as I thought it would. 
And it would have been nicer if they had a lip that came down like that far and went like that. You know what I'm saying? I would have liked that. That would have made it better and it would have been more structurally sound, I think. But it costs more money to do that, you know. So that's the look. Kind of cheaply made. I like them. I do. I'm just nervous that if a tr stick falls on them, sometimes I park under a tree for, you know, a couple hours because I have a tree right out here. Um, I'd be nervous that these get cracked, you know. And when you drive, you get a rattle. So put your music on. <laughs> so I'm not. I, it's winter time for me, so I have all this up when I drive it. I don't even drive it, but when I do, like if it's like 50 outside and I want to take it out, no snow, nothing. Um, all that's shot, and I usually have music on, so. I haven't tried it out with uh, the T-tops uh, off and the windows down. So that's, um, that will be a video in the summertime, an updated Louvers video. But yeah, so I'll do an updated uh, video in the summertime about the reaction at car shows I get with these. Because this car gets a positive reaction anyways. But that's the look. Um, if you want, you can follow my uh, Car Meets app uh, sticker thing. If you want to see all the mods that I've been doing, I'm starting to post more on it. But that's it right there. I bought this thing so people can scan the car and kind of just see it. So if you want to stay updated with the, the uh, mods I'm doing to this, use that. And I'll post it there or like my Instagram. I usually post stuff there. But yeah, so that's the look. Well, that's not the look. <laughs> that's not the look. That's the look right there. And I, I do like the side, though. I like the side. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Aesthetically, I think it's worth it. Uh, but I think they did a shit job making them. It's just cheaply made. I wish it was aluminum. Like, seriously. Come on. I'm going to have those on there for, you know, the lifetime of the car. So it's like, I would have liked metal. You know, you can easily repaint metal. These are textured. It's Oh, yeah, it has a texture to it. You see what I'm saying? Uh, what's a good, like, comparison to that? Kind of like a uh, like a grip on, like, a broom handle, maybe. I don't know. Um, kind of weird, but, yeah, maybe. That was the first thing I saw. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so that's the look. If you got them, let me know. Or if you got, you know what? If you have the, the three-piece, let me know what you think of those. I think it looks kind of weird, but... Let me know if you have them, because I'm curious. I almost bought them, and I've been kind of thinking about buying those, too, just to have both, just to kind of see what I like. But, yeah, that's the Louvers. Uh, yeah, thanks. Bye.